and then take them out like a Charlie Chaplin or a ballerina and then take your feet down to the sides. You're gonna get that hips distance apart with the feet. And then just very gently, just turn your feet so that the edges of your feet are parallel to the sides of the mat. What you'll find is you'll have a slight pigeon toe effect, but that's okay. So and just find yourself comfortable within that. Just standing up nice and tall. I just want you to drop your arms down by your sides, push your knees together, round them out, and you'll feel the weight move to the little toes of the feet, and then come back up and keep those no knees outwards. With your tailbone, you want to make sure that you're not arching through the front of your body, and you just want to let that tailbone gently open the lower back. So if you kind of contract through the front of your body here and tilt your tailbone forward, what you'll find is your lower back will ease off and that's quite important because we put a lot of effort into our lower back. So just by standing up properly, we're going to take the strain out.